Police are looking for the gunman who shot up a New Year's Eve party in North Spokane. An 18 year old woman was shot at least twice in the chest at Jefferson and Rockwell. That's where KXLY 4's Jeff Humphrey joins us live. Jeff, neighbors say they all knew this was going to eventually happen. Colleen, the people that we talked with today here, including the Blockwatch captain, say the owner of this bullet riddled home has turned it into a party house where young people come and drink themselves silly and then get into fights. And apparently early this morning, someone who lost one of those fights here came back and retaliated with a rifle. We all have at least one problem house in our neighborhoods and police say this one is the trouble spot here at Jefferson and Rockwell. This is a house that we've known about for a little while with parties and other problems. And last night the problems escalated as dozens of young people showed up for New Year's Eve. You can see them gathering in the street and you can tell by the attitude and the voices it was going to be a couple of fights. As many as 60 people were here around midnight. Fortunately, the crowd had dwindled by the time of the drive by shooting. Sounds like uh, somebody came back with uh, some type of firearm and fired numerous rounds into the residence and those rounds likely from a high powered rifle tore through every room of the house. At least two of them hit a teenage girl in the torso. And so right now detectives are processing the scene and collecting evidence uh, still trying to gather information on you know the the party goers and detectives are also fingerprinting glassware from the party and taking samples of the blood spilled in fights before the shooting happened. Neighbors say they don't know who the gunman is, but are well acquainted with the root of the problem. The officers all know this house. He told when they when they were talking to me last night at three, they says, oh, yeah, we know this house for all the drugs and and uh, some they call it gang related stuff, too. And yeah, we we'll hope so. We're all standing here hoping something happens. And tonight, the 18-year-old victim is in stable but critical condition at a local hospital. Major crimes detectives say they are confident they will identify the gunman. In the meantime, police warning our sons and daughters that if they are at a party and a fight breaks out, it's time to leave that party because all too often, a retaliatory strike is soon to follow. Reporting live in North Spokane, Jeff Humphrey, KXLY4.